Well, I got the job. I deal largely with the wafer level of operations. Uh, everything from interfacing with the fabrication facilities in Asia to get out our chips to measuring test structures on our wafers. This is a wafer probe station here, so we have tiny needles that can drop down onto our devices and we can uh, do characterization of, of currents and how the devices are operating. Uh, I also do a lot of sensor work, so improving our humidity sensor and our optical sensors. And I'm also involved in failure analysis. I started off actually, I did my bachelor's in physics, and while I enjoyed and appreciated it very much, I wanted to actually do something with my knowledge. So electrical engineering just seemed the natural transition to something more applied while still being able to use all that physics knowledge. This is my first real job. Uh, I came on as part of the new college grad program they have here at Scilabs. Uh, so I've been here a year and a half and I'm very grateful that they do have this program because it it's a good sort of transitory type uh, method to get these new students who are come out of school or academically minded. We're still in that you know assignment thesis writing lab research mindset and industry is different as I've learned obviously um, so it's good to come on board and and undergo that training and and have the guidance there that we're new and we have a lot to learn but I think also we have a lot to continue. We're actually in the failure analysis lab right now so uh, when chips come back with problems, we rip them apart and see what we're on. Basically we load the wafer in there and these guys each have tiny, they just look like sewing needles that will drop down and there's contacts on each of these little chips and uh, as you probably heard there's millions of transistors on each tiny device. So we can put down those needles and then measure current of specific devices and say okay this one's working, this one's not quite as we intended. Having a solid technical foundation, I think with that you can build upon it and pretty much go anywhere. Um, I did my grad work in far infrared sensors and now I'm working on, on uh, micromechanical oscillators and, and humidity sensors. So it's the skill set you build up is then easily applied and, and translated to other, other uh, applications. <laughs>